Before I do anything, I would like to thank Anna for giving me this kit. Thank you, Anna. I appreciate it. So following the instructions for installation, I took the two brass contact posts and inserted them into the insulator. After that, I took the screws and terminal lugs and I put them in through the insulator into the contact posts and I snugged them up making sure that the contact terminals were inside the circle of the insulator and we'll tighten those down. Then we'll put the insulator assembly into the base. Pushing it down, making sure the notch is lined up with the set screw hole. Then we'll use the Allen wrench provided with the set screw to tighten up the insulator. Back to the back side of the base, we're going to loosen up those terminal screws, spread them apart, and they'll be ready to take a cable. Then we're going to insert dowel pins into the bores in the base. Add the washer to each post. Clean up the ends of your thumb screws because they make the contact. Then we'll start assembling the levers. There's one Phillips screw that goes in one side of the left lever. And then the thumb screws go in with the supplied springs. The tension adjustment thumb screw also gets a Delrin nut. Then we're ready to assemble. We put the tension spring between the two levers and then we carefully put them on the posts. Then we're ready to install the pin retainer. Put that down over the tops of the dowels and press down until everything is snugly together. Back to the other side, we'll put our pan screws through the holes into the base and snug up. This is an American Morse Equipment Porta Paddle 2 Iambic Paddle. And I sound like a robot. And we'll tighten those up. That terminal you see on the back there is for the ground. Then we'll install the base using screws all the way up through to the base of the paddle. Add the sticky rubber feet so things can't move around. And there we go. We've got a paddle. Anna, thank you so much. Such a fun project to put together. And I look forward to doing CW uh, real soon. Thank you. Have a great day.